We are just three days away until the start of the Wisconsin State Fair. American Idol star Alex Miller performs opening night on the main stage. And in addition to live music, the fair boasts more than 80 new foods. And I guess probably half are deep fried, maybe even more. Carol, <laughs> come on. Everything has to be deep fried at the State Fair or well, drizzled with something. It tastes good, doesn't it? All right, preparations underway to make sure after you eat all the deep fried and drizzled foods, <laughs> you can ride the Wonder Wheel and Sky Glider safely. You want to make sure they're good for you and your family. Absolutely. Our Mary Jo Ola live at State Fair Park in West Dallas with more on what's being done to make sure everybody's safe. Mary Jo. Yeah, Carol, this year there are more than 40 different rides that you can check out here at the Wisconsin State Fair, but before and throughout the event, there are multiple inspections to make sure those rides remain fun and safe. The Wisconsin State Fair's rides will soon be up and running, filled with people making the most of a summer staple. I bring my kids, you know, every year to State Fair. Um, they're, they're seven and nine. You know, if these rides weren't safe, I, w I wouldn't want my kids riding them. And that's how our team treats these inspections. To get there, inspectors with Wisconsin's Department of Safety and Professional Services are doing critical work, checking the attractions from top to bottom. Dan Harris is the soon to be secretary of that department. Really, the key to safety on these rides is making sure they're well maintained. Are things appropriately lubricated? Are cotter pins in the right place? The, the, the next big thing, of course, is safety equipment. Are our seat belts and lap restraints operational? These rides are inspected daily. They do a self-inspection as well as our third-party inspector goes around and inspects throughout the day um, and into the evening. The Wisconsin State Fair Park's Executive Director, Sherry Black, says ride inspections started on Saturday. We asked why people should feel safe getting on a ride at the Wisconsin State Fair, considering riders in other states have been hurt. We actually are the managers of our Midway, so that allows us to pick all of our rides ourselves. So we always pick the most sought after best operators. Black says they won't tolerate anything that shows too much wear. We actually have had some rides in the past that we did not allow to um, operate during our fair after they came through that first initial inspection, they didn't pass. So they weren't allowed to operate and we don't work with those companies anymore. Now, if you or the kids plan to come out and enjoy the rides, Black strongly advises wearing good, safe footwear, so avoid wearing the flip-flops out here. Live in West Dallas, Mary Joola, TMJ4 News. You need the shoes to do all the miles you're going to put on <laughs> yeah, walking really. the midway. Mary Jo, thank you.